COVID-19 and the Lucifer Rebellion. About 200,000 years ago, the Lucifer Rebellion occurred. The Lucifer Manifesto made several points. The first one was that there was no God. And the second one, since there was no God, all beings were free to, to do their own will. They didn't have to do the will of God. Jesus taught that there is a God and that all men have free will, but they have the free will to make a decision. Do they do their own will each day or do they do the will of God? The will of God always involves the most good for the most beings for the longest time. So his manifesto was freedom. And today we still hear that same call that I am free to do what I want to do. And everyone that you hear saying that, you can assume has joined the Lucifer Rebellion, whether they meant to or not. We're only free to do the will of God. And when you don't get your shots, and when you don't wear your mask, what you're showing is that you only care for yourself, and that you don't care for anybody else around you. The whole kingdom of Jesus, much of the time, is spent on socialization, of teaching us to love and care for beings that are totally different than us. And so that lesson should be learned on earth, that we care about the brotherhood of man and the fatherhood of God. Each person is indwelt by the Spirit of God. And when you do something that hurts that person, you're also hurting the Spirit of God and the attempt to get our universe in stability. So whenever you hear somebody saying freedom, I have the freedom to do whatever I want to, be aware the devil is at work. In the world of Jesus, truth, beauty, goodness, and unity are the aspects that we know are his. When you see evil, ugly lies that divide us, you know that the devil is at work and that he's sitting on somebody's shoulder and whispering to him to say these awful things. You have immense responsibility to the kingdom of God to follow the will of God. And if every being is doing their own will and not doing the will of God, then only chaos can result in the cosmos. The only way the cosmos can come to total peace is if every being does the will of God, doing his part to make things better.